Mumbai & Co. It's an authentic Indian uh, Parsi cafe. Okay. Uh, basically, we are trying to bring the olden days of Bombay to the modern, vibrant Dubai. Okay. Um, so, obviously, if you can see the decor inside, okay, it's a lot of Bollywood posters. Um, the decor suggests, like, you know, it's, it's more of uh, emotions, I would say. Um, then the, just the decor, isn't it? Okay, when you walk into a restaurant, okay, you see some Bollywood posters, you see some house rules, uh, you see some Indian decors, okay, and you know, which kind of reminds you of the 70s Bombay. Uh, and the music is the key for this restaurant, like, you know, uh, like I think myself, and you know, most of my age, like 30, 35, I'm, don't get me wrong, I'm just 35. <laughs> so it's it's like, you know, we all have grown up with this music, uh, like 70s, you know, you, uh, you listen to your parents hearing this music, and that's what we are bringing to Dubai, you know. I've been working on this project from last one and a half year, one year now, okay, and uh, we have developed the concept. Uh, so, I obviously, uh, we have been to quite a lot of restaurants in Bombay, you know, a uh, few restaurants in uh, London as well, okay. It was a very unique concept uh, which we thought it is going to be uh, ideal for Dubai. Um, yeah, so that's what makes us do this. So, you know, even before just opening the restaurant, like me and my head chef, we actually went to Bombay for almost uh, like three and a half months before. Uh, did a tour of almost a couple of days, literally bought a hand-picked few posters, uh, like you know, these house rules, you know, like posters and stuff from uh, Chor Bazaar, like you see the TVs and all this thing, it was all hand-picked from Bombay itself. And we were flight over, it's so almost like 120 kgs we bought it. <laughs> Um, I think you know right now in Dubai it's bad. it's all about molecular gastronomy and you know it's all about smoke coming out of the plates and you know, <laughs> sometimes there's a fire sometimes there's a water pouring around so what we have kept the menu is very simple it's a simplicity is our key okay and you know it's actual food with a minimum garnish of just a coriander or a chili it's all about the flavors it's all about the taste and what you actually get in Bombay, mainly from the that's lots. The menu is influenced with a lot of street food of Bombay. Like you'll see Kima Pao, you'll see Wada Pao, and all those things. Uh, plus the Parsi delicious, like you know Patrani Bachi, you got the Salim Moog, those kind of dishes.